Hey you three, welcome to another music lesson. I uh, hope you're enjoying what's hopefully your last week at home. Um, so uh, I thought before we started I'd quickly give you the answers for the Tars and TTs for Double Double This This. So we already know the first two lines are T T T T Ta Ta T T T T Ta Ta. The next line was Double This Double That, which is T T for Double Ta for That. T T for double, uh, ta for that, so double this, double that, T T ta, T T ta, and the last line was double, double this, that. So it was T T T T ta, ta. Can you sing the whole thing in ta's and TTs and clap the rhythm for me? So it's going to sound like this T T T T ta, ta, and so on. Ready? Do it with me. Ready? Go. T T T T ta, ta. T T T T ta, ta. Sweet. Uh, first thing I want to do today is a song, and I think 99% of you will already know this song. It's called Hot Cross Buns. Uh, so the song goes like this. Uh, even if you already know the song, you can just listen to this one. It goes like this. Hot cross buns, hot cross buns, one a penny, two a penny, hot cross buns. Hopefully this is sounding really familiar to all of you. Uh, I'm going to quickly teach it to those, because I know that a couple of people won't know this one. So it goes like this, repeat after me. Hot cross buns, hot cross buns, ready go. Mm, 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 mm. And it goes, one a penny, two a penny, hot cross buns, ready go. Mm, 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 mm. Sweet. Uh, let's sing the whole song together. Make sure you sing with me, please. Here we go. Hot cross buns. Hot cross buns. One a penny, two a penny. Hot cross buns. Uh, I'm going to teach you something about the pictures in the song Hot Cross Buns. Okay? Um, and to do that, because uh, if we were at school... Uh, we would be learning about the glockenspiel. I'm going to use the glockenspiel to help me teach you about that. Sweet. Uh, so, uh, there are three notes in the song. There is a high note. Sounds like that. There is a note that is one step down. It's the note in the middle. So, high note, middle note, and the third note is the lower note. So there's a high one, a middle one, and a low one. And you can play the whole song using those three notes. Can you sing it while I play it? Ready, sing, hot cross buns, hot cross buns, one a penny, two a penny, hot cross buns. Sweet. So they are the three notes of the song. Uh, now what I need you to do is stand up find somewhere where you've got a little bit of room to move and get ready for the next part of the activity. So this is an activity you might have done with me in class before. Um, what I want you to do is to show what notes you're singing by putting your by using your body. Okay, so if you think you're singing a high note, I want you to put your hands on your head. If you think you're singing a note in the middle, a middle note, I want you to put your hands on your belly. And if you think you're singing a low note, I want you to put your hands on your knees. I'll be doing it too, so you can watch me. Uh, ready, let's sing the song together. We start on a high note. Ready, sing, hot cross buns. Hot cross buns. One a penny, two a penny. Hot cross buns. Nice. So uh, in the uh, hyperdoc that I've shared with you, I've written a few challenges for you, okay? And I want you, your job is to complete those challenges. Uh, one of the challenges is to sing it so that the notes, your head notes, are sung in your head. So the head notes are silent. I want to show you what that sounds like. Can you do it with me as well? So anytime you're singing a note on your head, I want you to make it silent, okay? So it'll sound like this. Do it with me. Here we go. Cross buns, cross buns, 
One a penny, two a penny, cross buns. Yeah, so uh, if you look at the, the lesson that I've shared with you, there uh, is a little list of challenges that I want you to do with that song. And they, they all revolve around singing certain parts in your head and, and things like that. Okay, so have a look at those list of challenges and your job is to complete those challenges for this song. So the next thing I want to do with you guys is is uh, a song that I can't believe I haven't done already with online learning. I was flicking through my folder this morning and I'm going, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? And I got to Tony Chestnut in my folder and I was like, what? Why haven't I done this with every class already? So uh, yeah, the song is called Tony Chestnut. Some of you might already know it. Uh, so I'm going to use my guitar to help you te te teach you this one because I haven't played enough guitar in, in quarantine and uh, it's, it's really nice to sing to, I think. The uh, song goes like this. You can just listen even if you already know it to this one. Tony Chestnut knows I love you. So that's the song, I'm going to teach it to you bit by bit. The first bit goes like this. Tony Chestnut knows I love you. Sing it back to me, I'm going to hum it. Ready, sing. <laughs> Next bit goes like this. Tony knows, Tony knows. Can you sing it back to me? Ready, go. <laughs> Then it goes back to Tony Chestnut knows I love you. It sounds like this. Tony Chestnut knows I love you. Your turn, ready, go. <laughs> Last bit goes like this. That's what Tony knows. Your turn, ready, go. <laughs> Sweet. So all the words are Tony Chestnut knows I love you. Tony knows. Tony knows. Tony Chestnut knows I love you. That's what Tony knows. Okay. So let's sing the whole song together. Ready, sing. Tony Chestnut knows I love you. Tony knows. Tony knows. Tony Chestnut knows I love you. That's what Tony knows. Momentarily forgot how to play the guitar, but that's alright. Uh, this time, can you sing it by yourselves? Ready? Here you go. Sweet. So that's the song. We're ready to learn the activity. So, uh, the main character of this song is called Tony, okay? Uh, Tony Chestnut is his name. And I can split up the name Tony into two syllables. I can hear two syllables in there. It's toe and knee. Uh, and they both sound like body parts to me, so I reckon when you say the, the syllable toe, you touch your toe. When you say the syllable knee, you touch your knee. Every time you say the name Tony, you're going, Tony. Alright, do it with me. Here we go. Tony Chestnut knows I love you. Tony knows. Tony knows. Tony Chestnut knows I love you. That's what Tony knows. Sweet. So, uh, Tony Chestnut's last name is... Uh, Chestnut, obviously. And I can hear two syllables in that as well. Chest! Um, so you're going to touch your chest when you say chest. And nut. No, it's not that. Uh, some people call your heads your nut. Okay, so uh, your nut is your head. So chest and nut. So it is Tony Chestnut. Do it with me. If you can, here we go. Tony Chestnut knows I love you. Tony knows, Tony knows, Tony Chestnut knows I love you. That's what Tony knows. 
Sweet, so, uh, so it goes Tony, Chestnut, the next two are, well the next words are knows I love you. So, knows and I. Tony, Chestnut, knows I love you. Do it with me. Here we go. Tony, Chestnut, knows I love you. Tony, knows. Tony, knows. Tony Chestnut knows I love you, that's what Tony knows. Getting confused yet? Because I am. Uh, the last, last two little actions are for love and you. And I can't think of a body part, part called love or you, so I'm just going to go love, make a heart with your fingers, and you point out to the front, or whoever you want to point to. Alright, ready? The whole thing, so we've got toe, knee, chest, Nut, knows, I, love, you. Here we go. Tony, chestnut, knows, I love you. Tony, knows, Tony, knows. Tony, chestnut, knows, I love you. That's what Tony knows. So, so it's trickier than it seems, isn't it? Uh, your job is to practice that little routine until you can do it. Um, and yeah, that's it. Practice that routine. So that's it for another lesson, Year 3. Uh, you've got two jobs again. Job number one is to do those challenges for the Hot Cross Bun song. You'll find them in the, in the little lesson. Okay? Um, and remember they're using the high notes, middle notes and low notes. I want you to do the actions for them as well. And your second job is to learn Tony Chestnut, and uh, just until you can do it comfortably. Great! There are your two jobs. See you later!